Okay, let's get back to quadrilaterals. Remember that the sum of the angles of triangles are up to 180 degrees? Well, the sum of the angles of a quadrilateral are up to 360 degrees. Why? Watch this. If a line is drawn across a quadrilateral, you get two triangles. Because each triangle has 180 degrees, 180 times 2 equals 360 degrees. May we apply the same logic to other polygons? Sure. How many triangles in a five-sided figure? Without crossing lines, of course. One, two, three. Three times 180 equals 540. So the sum of all the angles of a five-sided figure is 540 degrees. What about an eight-sided figure? One, two, three, four, five, six, six triangles. Six times 180 equals 1080. The sum of all the angles of an eight-sided figure is 1080 degrees, and so on. What this tells us is that there is a pattern here, and in math, patterns may be turned into an equation. So here it goes. The pattern that we see here is that every time we calculate a new polygon, we are, in reality, subtracting two sides of the polygon in question and then multiply the result of the subtraction by 180. Or, as an equation, it would be n minus 2 multiply by 180, where n is the number of sides of the polygon. Let's try the equation with some specific polygons. But before we do, let's give names to the polygons. First of all, polygons may be regular or irregular, and they may also be convex or concave. A regular polygon must be convex, and the size equal, giving us also all equal angles. And in an irregular polygon, of course, they're not. Also, a polygon is said to be convex when all the angles point towards the exterior of the polygon while in the concave polygon, at least one of the angles must be pointing towards the interior of the polygon. For example, the honeycomb and the stop sign are regular polygons because they are convex and all the angles are equal, while a star is an irregular concave polygon because all of its angles are not equal, although all the sides are equal. The sketch of a house is an irregular convex polygon while the one-way arrow is an irregular concave polygon. However, for now we will examine only those polygons that are regular. In other words, convex and with all equal angles. The table here shows the name of each regular polygon starting with the three-sided regular polygon, also called the equilateral triangle, whose interior angles are up to 180 degrees. Next is the square, at 360 degrees, then the five-sided polygon, known as the pentagon, at 540 degrees, next the six-sided hexagon, 6 minus 2 equals 4, 4 times 180 equals 720 degrees, then is the heptagon, or seven-sided, at 900 degrees, and the octagon, at 1080 degrees, after that, the nonagon, 9 minus 2 equals 7. 7 times 180 equals 1,260 degrees. And last is the decagon, 10 minus 2 equals 8. 8 times 180 equals 1,440 degrees.